So I just pulled over to here at Canarnet and uh, this is, I just saw something amazing. What's going on? So we can see we launched a weather balloon earlier today. Balloon, two balloons together. Uh, underneath them we had a package with the camera, a GPS, a small PC, PC 104, and, and the transmitter. And now we can watch at the GPS location over Google Earth. And so where are we now? We started in south of Kinneret. After that, we crossed the border to Jordan. Then we passed Irbid, which is a large city. We should have a picture from Irbid. We haven't opened it yet. Are you worried about the Jordanian Air Force shooting no, us down? Right now, we're way above the height of regular commercial airplanes. Well, the balloon itself is, cannot be seen on radar. It's a stealth balloon. No, it's just yeah. made out of latex. <laughs> now, what is this uh, harpy we're seeing over here? What so is this? What we're seeing here is actually the equalizer. So we're about to cross the border to Syria. Uh oh. And after that, if we're lucky, we might even reach Iraq. But that's like in a few hours from now. Now we're getting pictures. You can actually see the data being transmitted. Oh my god. Now that, that's like a modem? Wait. That's like a, a, a 1200 BPS modem. It's a modem? Yeah, it's like it will, the old modems. We still have modems here? Yeah, it's an old modem. But what it's a one-way. Ah. It's a one-way modem. I can't control anything. Okay, so, so they can't actually trace you back uh, by signal triangulation or something like that? They can. I'm sending GPS location in text. <laughs> uh, no, the, 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 the ah, no, no, no. I'm only receiving. I'm yeah. not transmitting okay. anything. Okay. Wow. Uh, so we can see so pictures. So what's your goal with all this? Uh, can we you just show, show the that. Last picture? Yeah, uh, this is one of the latest pictures taken over Jordan. The resolution is quite low because uh, we are really low on bandwidth. It's taking three minutes to transfer a 10 kilobyte picture, so Still? that's what we have. So what was it? What were you trying to prove this morning? Uh, we tried to prove that we can build a really cheap spy satellite using homemade equipment, things we bought on eBay. Really, something that anybody can How much can did do. Uh, this spy satellite cost you? The equipment that we put on the balloon was about five hundred dollars. Five hundred dollars for a spy satellite. Five hundred. So what do you do during the day when you're not building spy satellites? I'm an electronics engineer. Nothing special. This is the first time we launched. We ever launched the helium balloon. How many people are on your team? Three, three people: Nama, Achi, and I. And now we have to be so that. If the government wants to build a spy satellite, they can contact you. Uh, I, I'm not sure we had a lot of problems. <laughs> I'm not sure if this is a government standard. Yeah, yeah, for $500. We'll for $500, I think so. These are photos taken by this $500 spy balloon as it traveled from uh, Canarinet to Syria. Pretty amazing stuff. And uh, next up are the uh, Google Earth uh, representation of the flight path. Yarov did a great job with his team, blew my mind. And just an example of the creativity, the amazing ingenuity at Canarinet 2008.